Can you believe I started opening this box without filming it? <laughs> I got so many bad habits. Okay, so this is the Snacku. Um, it's a Japanese box. They send you snacks from Japan, which is what I really like. That in Korea. I'll be doing Korea soon. And this one I haven't opened yet. This. Wow. I'm actually having a hard time opening this. Anyways, so it's got Hokkaido. I wish I had gone to Hokkaido, but haven't been there. And this is what's supposed to be in it. I don't know if you can see that because I can't even see it. Yeah, I have no idea. But anyways, that's what's supposed to be in it. I wish I could get, there's a larger box that they have, which is like their heritage box. I think they call it a heritage box. It has way more stuff in it. Um, but it's like $39 a month. And a chick doesn't have that kind of moolah to be spending per month on snacks that I really can't eat. Because I'm really not, oh, that's broken. I don't know what this is, but this is Raguno? Oh, it's French. Ragueno. Rag I don't know how to say it. Ragueno. All that, all that French, and I still have a hard time pronouncing things. Unbelievable. But anyways, it looks like it's a little cookie, a little ginger snap cookie. I'm definitely gonna eat those. <laughs> and then the corn chocolate. Maybe I should open this. Yeah. I hope this is good. Uh-oh. I'm already breaking it. Leave it to me to break something. Come on. Okay. Ooh, this is good. Ooh, this tastes good. It's strawberry chocolate. Yeah, that's good. Moving along as I make a mess. I you get a pretty sizable amount of stuff. Peach gummy candy. I've had those. Those are good. The other corn chip. Then the... I have no idea what this is. What does it say on the card? It says cheese stuffed senbei. Senbei. Cheese stuff senbai. Well, I'll still try to eat it, but I may die doing that. And I give you a couple. Oh, I give you a pretty good amount. And then I'm assuming these are dried fries. Jaga pokuru. Jaga pokuru. So, and I'm assuming these are, it says these baked French fry snacks from Hokkaido are extremely popular. They are made from locally grown organic Hokkaido potatoes and kettle baked with sea salt from the Saruma Inlet Sea. The name of the snack comes from Koropokuru, which is a native Anu word for forest fairies. And Anu is the indigenous tribe of Japan. I think I'll talk about that later when I do more research on them, but I think I'm going to enjoy those. These must be pokey sticks. Are these pokey sticks? Yes, cookies and cream pokey. So they give you one packet. So the snack box version is pretty good. It's a decent snack box. These are jelly jams. I remember these when I was younger. I'm going to chew them hard because they're going to... Um, they can get stuck in your throat or something. I think there was issues with these, but um, they're good. Melon jelly, it says. Melon jelly flavor. I guess they grow melons there. They give you a good amount of stuff for the snack box. And the snack box is like $15, so it's not too bad. Which one is this? Candy assortment. So it's just a part of the candy assortment that they give you. Um, super cola. I'm not eating that. It's soda flavored. 
I'm gonna eat it, but uh, I'm gonna regret it. And here's Calbi. Where's this? It says it's Calbi Kappa Ebison. It's these lightly salted baked shrimp. Flavored crisps are by far the most popular snack in Japan. Not soybeans were, but I guess not. And I guess I need to eat those soon. Um, yeah, but that's pretty much it. It's a small box packed with a lot of stuff. So snack box. I guess you can get just as much from the snack box. So that's not bad. That's pretty good. But that's it for the snacku Hokkaido snacku subscription box.